Hello and welcome to this energy update, update of the heart. And I feel it's very, very prominent at the moment what is going on in the universe, the energies that are coming through, the sun flares and all of that. I'm not an astrologer, but I do feel the energy and it is hugely important that we actually understand what these constellations are doing for us and how we can weave them into our life. So all what's happening right now, very clear to me, is about us really evolving, us stepping up, us shifting. And so this full moon, again, is a very beautiful opportunity. So beyond the astrology that I appreciate very, very much, there is a clear sense for me that the universe really wants us to start opening up these new horizons of consciousness. And the only way we can really do it is by daring, daring to take even healing and our wounds into a next level, not keeping the wounds. And, and this, is, this is very, very important. So this full moon, 3rd, 4th of June, is actually a particular beautiful time to really release and heal deep wounds in our relationships. Whether it's the romantic relationships, whether it's your relationship with nature, with the world, with the universe, it's all up to you. But I am so clear, it's, it's such an amazing opportunity for all of us to take this opportunity to allow these frequencies and these energies of the cosmos to support us in stepping into these new horizons that, frankly, we don't know, especially in this physical form. Although we may call ourselves spiritual and enlightened and conscious and all of that, there's still so much that we actually don't know. So when the universe gives us these beautiful gifts of release and of deep healing, I feel it's crucial to enter in these new dimensions of consciousness, to enter in these new ways of living. And so I'm inviting you to do your own ceremony, to do your own thing. What is it that can you can release? What is it that has held you back for so long? What is the wound that still aches and pains? And it doesn't mean that you haven't done a good job on your healing journey. It just means we have an opportunity to go deeper. And so be open. It could be many things. Maybe you are not in the flow. Maybe you don't have a relationship with the flow of life, the flow of the cosmos, the flow of this whole ascension process. Maybe you still feel shy about stepping up and shining your light. Maybe you still don't really know what this is all about and you lack clarity. And it's like you're repeating over and over the same because you haven't been able to truly connect to your heart and find that truth. So this is the invitation. Don't be shy. This is between you and the universe. This is you, this human experience that you have chosen. You are the creator of what happens, but of course you are not alone because we are all creating. But as we are coming more into our own unique wholeness, we may learn to co-create even more amazing things together and surely a new consciousness new octaves and new dimensions of consciousness that allow us to truly be who we are. So I hope you have a wonderful time for this full moon and I hope you find your ways to celebrate, to let go and to heal. If you have any questions, you can put them in your comments below. And of course, if you want to subscribe, we appreciate that. A lot because we are here to build community we are here to share the love and the magic and the light and we are very happy if you engage with us or if you enjoy our 
music to meditate or whatever we have to offer. For us, it's about connection. For us, it's about being in this together. So thank you so much and let us know what your questions are and how you are going into this full moon and how deep you dare to heal. Thank you so much. Much love from my heart to yours.